Alright, this is about season 10 of The Ultimate Fighter. And in this, I saw one of the bloodiest UFC fights ever. Abe Wagner <coughs> fought John Madsen. And uh, a little background here. Abe Wagner, he's a... Uh, a director of finance and operations and uh, <laughs> it doesn't sound like a very tough guy and he actually went into the fight pretty scared uh, you couldn't tell by the fight itself <laughs> the whole fight was him scooping John Madsen dumping them, beating the crap out of them. I mean, the whole fight. Rampage Jackson, who is, I don't know, he's, he's somewhat of an idiot to me. I mean, really, he's had some major, major knockouts in the UFC, but I don't think he's the best coach. He goes in there and he's like, my team has the biggest guys and size matters you know oh, okay sure the, look at Fedor Emelianko versus Hongman Choi you know sometimes skill wins over size you don't get too much bigger than that dude right so <sighs> you see just a puddle of blood as he's beating him. He's got a cut deep into his forehead that you see at the end of the fight. I mean, deep. They're talking about that they can see the bone. You can't see it watching the fight, and I'm sure you could see the fight. You can search it. You can see the fight. Um, but what I uh, what I disrespected is Rampage. He's, he's yelling, get up. I mean, get up. Like, the guy's pinned against the thing, tied up on his legs, and he's getting beat down. He's not telling him, like, you know, use your hips or flip your leg over. He just get up, and, you know, with a little thumbs up. Uh, up. <laughs> you know? Of course he wants to get up. You know, give him some instruction, maybe? Uh, I don't know. Plus, his heart wasn't in it. They, the ref kept standing him up, and he kept getting scooped down. He had no takedown defense. None. I mean, zero. And uh, I don't know if he knows how to block a punch to the face because he seemed to take every last one of them. Uh, Wagner was tagging him 100%. I mean, I don't think Wagner missed once in the whole fight. He just tagged him. Um, there's a lot of rumors that Kimball is supposed to fight. Uh, this Wednesday and I think that's I think that's great I don't think he'll make it out of this I think he'll still fight in the UFC I don't think he'll make it out of this and win the finals uh, they showed a little exercise of Kimbo moving around and even his coaches said that uh, he's got absolutely no ground game uh, he'll, he'll say like, you know, like you'll notice improvement and whatever. Right, that's great. But that doesn't even mean he won anything. Because John Manson stayed in the house and continued receiving training after the fact. You don't have to leave when you lose. So... A. Wagner beat the shit out of John Manson all day. Rampage stormed off like a poor sport. He picked him. He trained him. He was the only one that could prepare him for this fight. And dude, I don't know. Uh, the, Rampage has no one to blame but himself. And I can't wait till, can't wait till the next fight.
so far it's been great.